Chess friends, how are you? Hope you are good and today I will show you the legendary chess game of Alpha Zero and me. In this game I sacrificed my two two rooks and two knights against Alpha Zero. This is the greatest game of 2023 so let's go. I started the game with e4 we have e6 French defense, d4 d5 knight c3. Last day we saw classical variation of French defense by Magnus Carlsen, but Alpha Zero played knight c6, blocking away his pawn from moving, so e5 by me. You can play f6 move to open king diagonal which will be totally okay black, another idea is to play knight e7 to go g6 square, but alpha 0 is a self-independent guy, he played b6 to use his bishop on this stupid looking diagonal, alpha 0 is developing his queen side so I decided to rush king side with the h pawn because black may castle on king side, we have queen d7 h5 bishop b7, this bishop and queen move clear that he wants to go in queen side, so after knight f3 we have long castle. Alpha Zero comments, fool stockfish, now your kingside h pawn is wasted because I am in queen side, no donkey, I have bishop f4 with the strategy of a4 a5, bishop b5 to pin the knight, so h6 bishop back to d2, re-rotate your knight to play a4, a5 with the supporting of the bishop, knight e7 bishop g3, g5 takes takes knight back to e2 h5 a4 threatening to play a5 with the bishop and rook support, so alpha played a5, bishop b5 to pin the knight. Now my new plan is to push these pawns to clear the position and target to the a5, bishop d7 so b4, threatening to take it then takes then re-rotate your knight to target the a5 square with the knight and bishop, rook will get the open b file which will be bad for black so he decided to take the pawn with bishop, bishop takes takes a5, if you take the pawn on a5, let me show you the variation, then after takes knight c1 rook g8 knight b3 to target the pawn with rook. Queen d8 knight will arrive on there to destroy you, takes takes queen here to go to the a5 square to target it, so after queen here rook takes pawn knight f4 to target the queen, queen runs away to target it, your king position is totally bad and you will be dead lost because your pieces will be dumb, takes here knight backs check here rook a1, this is coming and you can't stop checkmate even if you are the god, so back to the position we have queen e7 to protect it. a6 bishop a8 a7 and look at this pawn, he is one move away from his destiny, so knight a5 threatening to push the pawn to offer a pawn exchange to open the rank for the queen, ok we have c3, threatening to play queen a4 then bishop a6 check, you have to play correctly so rook g8 to create breathing room and threatening to take this pawn, so I sacrificed my rook on a5, pawn takes queen to a4 threatening to play bishop c6 to target the bishop, if you dare to take the bishop then after queen takes c6. Pawn promotion will be unstoppable, that's why we have c6 by alpha 0 to target the pawn, I played bishop a6 check king d8 queen takes check queen here. Takes. Black give me two pawns to win up the past pawn, bishop back to all the away, now I have to develop new strategy and tactics, alpha played knight f8, castle knight d7 threatening to play c5 so queen to b2, the rook is coming to a1 to seize the files, queen c7 by alpha, rook here king h7 queen d2, the knights are looking so powerful to attack black territory, queen f4 to target it, bishop b7 knight h4, rook g4 g3 c5 knight f4 threatening to play bishop e2 to kick out the rook. Bishop c6 bishop e2 rook backs king g2 king d8 bishop here backs here b2 queen c6, and after some moves later we have queen d2, threatening to play c4 to target the pawn with 1 2 3 pieces, the diagonal will be open and position will be critical for you, so queen d6 queen d1 king here rook here and after two moves later we have queen c1, the pawn can't take the d pawn because of this so we have knight b6. Takes knight c4 knight d3 to go to b4 to target it and the queen can go like triangle to pressure black, queen a2 and I sacrificed the rook on b7, to expose the king, queen goes to f4 to target the pawn, so rook h7, knight b4 to target this and threatening c6, queen b3 queen d4 to protect everybody and threatening to play c6 then bring the queen with knight to create troubles for alpha, so alpha moves back his king, c6 queen here queen d3 to target the rook here knight takes d5. I sacrificed the knight, if you dare to take the knight then queen b1 check will come, king can't go there because of this so after king here check, here checkmate, 
game will be over so back to the position, we have queen a2 to protect that square, knight f5, I sacrificed my another knight, if you take the knight, then c7 check will come, here takes and check, king b7 and the king will be in front of my sniper, I will send him moon, and chess friends. If you want to become like stockfish then subscribe to my youtube channel where you will get amazing chess contents from us, so after takes knight takes rook, takes takes the game turned into queen and a bishop versus queen and rook, but I am totally winning the game because I have passed pawns and its combination. Wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.